everyone. So today I have a new product I just purchased that I wanted to talk about. These are the Cloud Island bowls and plates for feeding from Target. Part of Cloud Island's expansion included some feeding items, placemats, that sort of thing. So um, I ordered these online a few days ago because my local Target did not have them in stock. And they came today and I tried them out. And the reason I ordered these is because they were both microwave safe. So the dishes we use now for our daughter, they are like the take and toss ones, which I don't even know are microwave safe, but we've thrown them in there a few times. They've kind of melted and they're in rough shape. And then the other ones we have are the Ikea little plastic kitty ones. I think they're like the Calas with a K uh, that everyone has. You know, they have them like literally in piles of bins as you walk downstairs to like the where all the crap is at Ikea. So... We've been using those and I wasn't really impressed. So I wanted to give these a try because they looked heavier duty. These are a harder plastic. Um, another thing when I had read online, it said they had a rubber grippy so that they wouldn't like be pushed around or anything. So I got the neutral prints or boy prints that sat on my receipt. It's kind of a light blue, a gray, and a mint green. They're very nice. These are really similar to like the Replay brand cups and bowls. If you've seen those, they brag about being made out of milk jugs. They sell them at like Target and Walmart. And we have a couple of their divided trays too. But I found that if I put my baby's food on the divided tray, like I'm giving her three different things and she eats the one she wants and then she throws the rest on the ground. So one of the major appeals of these for me was the non-slip bottom because mine's a pusher. She'll take her bowl and she'll push it just right off the edge of that high chair because, you know, that's nice. So I wanted something that was a little grippy that maybe would deter her. Now, I was pleasantly surprised at like how grippy these were. But if you see this little ring here, that's all the grippy. There is no more grippy than that. Plates are the same way. You know, obviously, bigger grippy rim around the plate here. But otherwise, not super grippy. Now, it did have like a decent amount of grip to it. Like it wasn't sliding all over. They are pretty lightweight, like durable bowls. Um... So, I, I mean, I think overall they're nice. I like them, obviously. You know, I'll keep them. Uh, one of the things that did bother me, like, a little bit, though, like, you can see it's, like, shiny. Like, it goes from this nice matte look to shiny. So, like, online it, it doesn't appear like that. So, I thought it would all be this matte. So, that's a little weird to me. Especially with this weird big lip and then nothing in there. But, I don't know. Overall, I like them. I don't love them. Um, I'll keep them. I don't plan on returning them or anything. It is nice to have this rubbery grip. Maybe as my kid gets older, she'll stop throwing her stuff around so much. But I think if you can afford it in spring for like the Munchkin brand cups and like bowls that have the big suction cup on them to suction onto the high chair, that might be a better fit for some people. At the same time, I see into like the big mats that are just like the whole big things that cover the whole high chair tray. That would be a good option too if you're really looking for something that stays put just because these are so lightweight that they're going to be tossed around pretty easily but my little one she kind of tried to move it she picked it up a few times but she couldn't slide it right off the tray so i was like eh, maybe that works the plates do have a big nice lip on them easy to kind of push food up against to get it off there so i was happy about that i do like the plates a little more than the bowls I don't know. I just expect them to be all matte here. Like, doesn't that just seem weird? I don't know. Maybe I'm weird. I just feel like with Target's whole sleek thing lately that just seems a little odd. But overall, I will say Cloud Island plates, bowls, they're okay. Not as awesome as some of the other new Cloud Island products are, but if you're looking for something that's a good value, uh, $3.99 a piece. So $4 for the three plates, $4 for the four for the three bowls. And at $3.99 a set, can't really go wrong. But if you can afford to spring for the ones that do have the actual suction stuff on the bottom, that might be a better bet. Anyways, I hope that helps. And any questions about these products, please leave me a comment. Thanks.